and we're off. It's the Saturday wrap. The Saturday wrap for Saturday. You wouldn't guess that one. Saturday the 14th of January 2023. Got that right. 10.43 hours. Greenwich Mean Time. Yeah. So, I look back on a week of being on leave. <laughs> anyway, okay. So, uh, you've seen this before. If you haven't, it's a retrospective. It really is. Anyway, so the word or phrase of the week flooding there was flooding over the weekend when i was in hereford i saw a drone picture just of the other side of the bridge uh, on the saturday while i was there oh, there was a lot of flooding i couldn't see it but there was a lot of flooding and um yeah uh thursday yeah thursday was flooding the rumley valley line was shut um and um the Round the valley was cut off from both ends and today it's similar the Romney Valley line is shut and the line between Cardiff and Bridgend is shut um, public transport um, and the A470 has one lane closed and there's flooding in Ponty uh, we never learn it rains here and we don't do very much about it at all and tips yeah Anyway, so that's the word of the week. Yes, January, flooding. Normally, we have to wait until February for this nonsense. And it's turning colder. And there's snow for the week ahead forecast. Um, just had Wales Online from the Met Office saying, what's it like? Um, we may or may not get away with it. Who knows, to be perfectly honest. Um. Okay. The app of the week. Well... I think I said last week, uh, last pass, you just need to get off there. Um, still nothing in the way of feedback. Um, there has been issues, but, you know, has my vault gone? Um, when did it go? When was it backed up? That, all that sort of stuff. So, on Monday, extracted all the info out of it. Here's a tip of the week. Don't use the website. Use the um, web browser extension. Um and then you can um, get it out as a CSV, common separated values, straight into um, one password. Had a 25% off by using a code from a guy on um, YouTube. It was very good. Really, really good. Um, and it just works. Um, I have a considerably longer unique password and there's some salt gone into it as well. And there's two factor authentication. not good when firms get bought out and they change hands a lot of times it's a bad sign get out of there filmic pro looking at you and evernote anyway um the thing of the week the thing of all the week harry um he's had a hard time i know and yeah he lost his mother but a lot of people have had similar sorts of things and all that and now he's complaining about his privacy and all that and he's on the tv all the time and his book and whatever yeah no harry uh, if you're not going to be a royal don't be a royal and just get on with something else um, you're just milking it at the moment you really are yeah and the rona Okay, so um, release the Kraken, um, which we are tending to use in this country, but no one else is. And all I'm seeing is people outside, especially this week when it's blowing a gale, so you're not going to catch it outside, wearing masks. And they're either round their chins or under their nose, and it's like, no, nah, that isn't going to do anything about it. You're going to catch it when you're indoors with other people you're better off boosting up your immune system because yeah that's how we fight these things to be perfectly honest well we shall see anyway um oh yeah beer from morrison's glide salt factory drop project sent, sent alcohol by volume really rather good 
really, really rather good, to be perfectly honest. Um, okay, yeah, last Saturday after this, which I did in the King's Fee, onto the Hereford Beer House. I can't say too much, but presents were purchased. Um, not for anyone in the family, though, but uh, colleagues. Um, I need to go back there more often. I'm thinking the next time will be February for Tiny Rebel's birthday. They usually have all their birthday beers. I just need to find out when that is. Um, I'll pin Sean. He'll tell me. He's top man and has no luck at all with either cooling or heating. Really is unlucky. Um, but he's very good at his beers. Very, very good at his beers. Um, a Sunday morning, I woke up with an email from the National Lottery to say, you've won something. Normally, it's... Yeah, normally, it's just like, oh, uh, yeah, lucky dip. It wasn't. It was 30 quid. But 30 quid is better than not 30 quid. So, I withdrew it straight away. Like the wind, to be perfectly honest. Um, <laughs> I... Put it in a fund for something. I think it was... I can't remember what it was, to be perfectly honest. But <laughs> I'm saving it. I'm just not going out crazy and spending the whole thing. Um, but there you go. And, um, yeah, Anne's birthday. My father's wife. I sent her some flowers. I sent them early because, you know, things are tricky at the moment. And then they didn't arrive. And then they did arrive and... <laughs> yeah they did arrive um but on the note it said put it in the shed and they don't have a shed and i should have made it clear who it is from but yeah whatever monday return um and then in the afternoon it was one password and also new car insurance yeah, um, apparently there's some law now that you are supposed to give um, people who come back for a second year the same deal as new users. It was 50 quid more expensive, to be perfectly honest. So I did a bit of a search around. I went back to Liverpool, Victoria. They came out as cheaper. And I also dropped for the first time in ages class one business insurance because in the last year I didn't use it at all. So it was really expensive for something I didn't use. And two... Yeah, I'm not going to get involved in that anymore. I'm just going to go to work, do my work, come home. Um, I had 40 years last year. I'm fatigued. Very fatigued, but there you go. Um, Tuesday, Tuesday afternoon was watching films. There are a lot of Russian films on Prime. There was one called Space Walkers. I think it was 2017. It was really well done, and it was... I enjoyed it, and it was interesting to see how critical they were of the 60s Soviet regime. Not bad at all. Um, prime, if you've got it. Um, what else? Uh, Wednesday. Wednesday made the decision to stick with my iPad Pro. I don't really need it for well, updating for anything else, and it's still working well. And the update of this year, apart from the M2 processor, really isn't anything better. I need a much better camera in it, so I'm just going to sit tight. If it breaks in the meantime, I got a new one. Otherwise, I will wait possibly 18 months for a new iPad Pro 11 inch. If there still is an iPad Pro 11 inch, it might just be an iPad Air at 11 inches. I'm not altogether sure, to be perfectly honest. Thursday, as I said, lots of rain, lots of flooding. Uh, Club Pennebont got flooded again. Yeah, Centra Ponty, we've learnt nothing, nothing at all. Um, also, when was it? Tuesday? Yeah, it was Tuesday. Renewed my passport. Um, and then had to send the old one off. Thursday it was there. Um, I had it signed for, so I went online to check that it had arrived. Worst signature ever. It's just like a bit of a square. It was even worse than mine. Um, so I'm going to be tracking my passport as it is renewed. And I managed to get in early enough just to make sure, just to make sure that the price hadn't gone up, which it is going up in the near future. But there you go. 
Uh, also on Thursday, um, watched 400. Um, these were films I'd bought before, and they were on iTunes. 400 is... Ooh, a little bit, yeah. Not the greatest of films, but enjoyable. And The Kill Team. That was good. That was very good. I actually might spend the afternoon in front of the Apple TV again today and watch some more films. Friday, yesterday, Twitter third-party API went down. Surprisingly not for everyone. And it's been silence from Twitter, although they've got rid of their... um communications department it just shows how bad the twitter client is compared to well i use tweetbot um luckily um i can't think of the name of it tweet deck is still working but it's not a mobile product elon need to get your act together you are ruining this product you really are <sighs> and today yeah today it's flooding again Oh, happy day. So that's it for this week. Um, upload and off we go. Bye-bye.